Wo ist das? Wo ist das? Good day, Miranda. We are back. This is visit number two. All right, so catch me up. How did you feel after your first adjustment? I felt great. Okay. I, I felt really great after. I was telling everybody about it. All right, how do you feel today? Let's start off low back. Let's start off with some low back stuff. Um, I mean, I did work a very, very long shift, and I worked all week, so um, my back was a little sore this morning. Okay, that's fair. And yeah. uh, uh, so let's go right here on the sacrum. So left versus right, left versus right. Is one more tender than the other? Um, they're about pretty, oh, well. It's pretty close, right? Yeah, they're about close. All right, let's do this. Turn to the left. Okay, now turn to the right. Okay, how's that feel right there versus the other side over here? Does one feel more restricted? Any pain, discomfort? Um, We're gonna go back this side. Yeah. Five, four, three, yeah. yeah. One, four. Yeah. Left, five, four. A little bit of a spasm there on four, but not as bad on this side, right? Yeah. All right, so let's do that one more time. Turn to the right. Okay. Oh. Yep. Okay, not terrible though. Let's see. Your hands feel good though. <laughs> Thanks, are they warm? Yeah. All right, a little bit of low back stuff going on. Do you have any neck shoulder stuff today? Um, yeah, so I I frequently get shoulder pain on this side. Okay. Um, and my shoulder was flaring up last night at work. It was really bad actually. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Ooh, ow, ow, ow. Rhomboid muscle. Both rhomboids. You feel it? Mm-hmm. So there's a little bit of soft tissue stuff here. Rotator cuff as well. Don't say that. That's like. Oh no no. That, that makes me think surgery. Oh good. No, you don't have to even worry about that at all. Not even close. Surgery is last resort. You only get surgery if you have to. And uh, rotator cuff surgeries usually come after like either a major trauma or decades oh. of wear and tear. This is just your sore you worked yesterday. That's okay. All right, so we have some muscle stuff to take care of. Any headaches? Um, no. Bring your head back. Stiffness there. Tension. Do you have tension here right now? A little bit, yeah. yeah it feels like a little. You don't really want to flex. Good. Go to the left side. Right side. Does one feel more restricted than the other? Yeah, when I go to the left. Left, there, restricted, okay. When you go this way, do you feel it over here on the right? Yeah, mm-hmm. Okay, that's muscular. Mm. C2 on the left. The cervical spinal muscle right there on the right. All right, let me check some of the glute muscles out here. Okay, glute minor, a little bit on the right side here. That's tender, right? Yeah, that felt weird. <laughs> All right, very good. All right, let's do this. Go ahead and stand up for me. 
You're gonna feel my fingers on the back of your hamstrings. I'm gonna trace up to the bottom of the glute fold. Feet are even, we're lower on the right. That means your right hip is back like this. Feet are even looking from the top and then your right hip is out like this. That actually matches what we saw last time. All right, Miranda, let's do it like this. First, go ahead and close your eyes. Okay, just looking for postural sway here, seeing if there's any motion. Okay, just a little bit of front to back, not too bad. Okay, you can open your eyes. Your hands drop. Good. High left hip, high right shoulder, so that's a good compensation there. Yeah, so the high right ear with the high right shoulder, so I don't suspect any upper cervical uh, deviations there, but it's mostly just a, a lean to that side. All right, turn around and face this way again. All right, and then go ahead and march in place, please. March? Yeah, 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 give me a march, yeah. Yeah, go for it, yeah, do the whole thing. All right, that's good. And I don't see any rotations. Keep going. Keep going? See, oh, okay. Yeah, I don't see any rotations in the pelvis. The feet are coming up straight down, uh, up and down straight. Okay, you can stop there. No genuvarum, no genuvalgum in the legs. That's good. Yeah, sorry. Me apologizing for myself not breathing. <laughs> nice, gentle breathing. soft sprayers where when it sprays it goes you know
Oh, you're pushing so hard. <laughs> Sorry, that was so, so, so loud. My foot just came out that way. Oh, you mean it, you weren't joking? Uh, I thought I was. I thought you were saying it to like be funny. No, I was being serious. No, okay. Well, guess what? I'm actually not pushing that hard. That's the thing. It's like the perception is is because you're sensitive here because this muscle has inflammation. Yeah. Because it's overworked. Yeah. And so we're we're getting in there because like that stress and in first of all the inflammation is just swelling. So we're like moving the fluids around. We're getting all the tissues around the segments, around this like one tendon right here. Yeah. Oh. Like so, I want to go above that and below oh. it to really maximize whew, this tissue's efficiency. I just yeah. want to clear out all the junk. My shoulder always gives me problems. Breathe into your nose. Oh. Breathe. Ow. You're doing good. There it goes.
took a deep breath in through your nose. trap fibers. All right. Okay, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Which one was the most tender? Three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Five. Five on the right over here, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So the, the fifth trap fiber tells us 95, 84, 76, that we need to adjust T7 and L3. L3 is just above the one that we found on the palpation there. So let's start off with this T7. Here's T1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, this muscle right here is telling me it needs to go this way. So we're going to give this a little push in this direction. Nice and gentle breathing, sinking in, following the breath down like this. And that was good, but there's still one more here. So let's do this. Nice breath in and out. I'm gonna let the shoulders sink. Good. Okay, let's get this one down here. Go ahead and take a deep breath in as far as you can go. As you breathe out, we'll start to push the shoulders go. Oh, I wasn't breathing out. That's okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's okay. Let's try it again. Deep breath in. Top of the breath. Let your shoulders relax. Good. Now let it all go. <laughs> all right. One more time. One, two, three, four, five. Still tender up there? No, it's not that bad. All right, nice and gentle breathing. All right, so we have an SI joint here to, to deal with. So we're going to do this. We also have that right restriction. So this right rotation restriction, so it doesn't want to go this way. So I'm going to adjust the L3 first, okay? That's five. That's four. That's L3 right here, and this one's going in this direction. So nice and gentle. Go take a deep breath in. And out. And let your shoulders relax right here. Go right there. Nice. Okay, on your back. Okay, nice, gentle breathing. Shoulders coming up like this. Good. Now adjust the SI joint on the right. Good. Yeah. On your back. Right, go ahead and turn your head to the right, back to center, turn your head to the left, back to center, again to the right, center, now bring your right ear down to your shoulder, center, left ear, center.
look nice and gentle breathing. Sinking in, following the breath, we're gonna come nice and gentle right here in that direction. <laughs> oh, that was crazy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gotta let it go, shoulders. Oh. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the stuff. <laughs> Between your knees, squeeze. Harder. <laughs> okay, put your legs Was up. that supposed to happen? <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh. <laughs> locate this, my first spine in the belly button. Yours is right there. And then the ASIS, front of the hip bone. Yours is here. Trace up towards the belly button in that direction. This is how we find. Sickle valve. Yours is right here. Did you eat anything yet today? No. Super empty, yeah. Let's go next to the pyloric sphincter. So we find the belly button here, two inches above that is here. Nice. Okay, nice deep belly breaths. Good, and out. Got them. Good, it's almost there, last one. I'm gonna bring this in this direction like this. I'm gonna pull like this, okay? Okay. Okay, another deep breath in. And out. as crazy as the first time. That was a good one. Yeah. Good job. Oh, thanks. You too. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I feel great. I, I, the first time I was definitely nervous because I had never gotten an alignment before, but I was really looking forward to today, especially after working a double yesterday. I was like, yeah, I'm going to go and I'm going to feel so good out there. So I'm actually, I'm really looking forward to like the next couple of days and seeing how I'm feeling. So yeah, I feel good. My neck feels great too. So I'm very happy. Okay, push back. Push your elbow back. Oh, back. Oh, sorry. Yep. Push, push. Push. Harder. I'm trying. Me <laughs> <laughs> just grab. It was painful. <laughs> All right, uh, put your hands on your other hip. I mean, put, yeah, yeah. Yeah, push here. All right, bring your chin down to your chest. Yeah, we're gonna go like this here. Good. This one up here. Good.
crazy. Oh.